Oh man. <laughs> no, like your aunt. Hello. Oh shit. All right. I'm gonna do it right now. Oh man, talk some shit real quick, Lar. You mean? Yeah, Lar on the pay. Feel he's most wanted. Big Lar, not the little one. That's all. Edward. Damn, you can't handle the P. Yeah, and they said I'm You heartless for real, for real. You they know, a lot of people time. asked me and told me don't do this and ask me. Why you gonna do Pilar? Oh, that's a fact. We don't get into it and shit like that, that. You mean? And I just feel like you just got a story. Just come oh, from like Philly, you all got damn like stories. Tell me what you know about the hood life. I can paint a picture what it look like. You know we can tell you ain't from around here. Why they so scared? It's a good life. You know the shots keep bumming, cops keep running in. Ops we hunting, they trying to stop the hustling. And we don't ever leave the house without it, huh? Everybody so want from really body boy. Let's talk to him a little bit, Lord. Why the city hates you so bad? I, well, I don't want to say why the city hates you, but why just, motherfuckers be hating on you so bad? I don't know why. I just be knowing me vibe and catch the vibe on that. Like, I ain't never mind nobody ever day in my life. That shit is just a moment. Do you believe it or you're not going to believe it? But the real niggas edge you say, fuck with me, like. Real shit, though. Because you definitely be everywhere in the city as far as, like, everywhere that you say you need to be and shit like that. Not in places that you unnecessary, you feel me, and shit like that. So. Take them back for real, for real. How you even get the name as far as like Lars? That's your real name or that's like a it's hand? It's a part of my name. Yeah, it's a part of my real name. Okay, we ain't got to get a whole government out. You know what I mean? It's a part of my real name. They call me there or they call me XO. They XO. Call me big Lars, because not the little one. Okay. Not the little one, the big one. Okay. So, what part of the city you from? from Germantown, but I grew up on G Street. Damn, what I'm saying. Okay. G Street, damn. Trenches. Okay, so Frank, that's definitely trenches. So you from the, like the Frankfurt section for real, for real. It's not giving Frankfurt, it's giving it. Allegheny, G and Allegheny. G and Allegheny, so, uh, so it's like the, what's the, the cutoff point? Not to get too the deep into this shit, like, but. The cutoff point is like right there. Like right, once you hit Frankfurt, Allegheny, that's Frankfurt. Like, let's pass that. Okay, okay, okay. So, so you definitely from the trenches for real, for real. And they get a lot of money down there too, though. There's so much money down there, but I had to go. That's all, it. that's all. Yeah, man. So, like I said, like the last couple years, for real, for real, like you've been popping in the city. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Just your name and popping and page again, deleted, no bitches hating. I've been ringing bells since I was like 14. Remember when I started doing the Ruthless videos? If everybody remember that. When she first said this, I didn't know what she was talking about for real, for real. I'm gonna keep it real. But uh, I just went back, did my research, and I started looking around online and shit, and it popped right up. Crazy because they captured the whole sling and they're just doing as far as like, you know how we talk and all that when niggas get serious and swearing and shit. So it made me think like, damn, maybe all this shit really, really is just cat. Maybe she just like portraying that role from a kid, you feel me? Because like once you get that certain type of attention as a kid. Motherfuckers will fall in love with the character, you feel me? So. Okay, so you always been around. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up. But now it was like it's different though. Now, no, it's like. Yeah, that shit worked though. That 14, it was when I was like 14, 15, 16. It was kind of like 
Oh, love at one point. Yeah, that shit like a mixture. Don't tap off, Lord. Don't tap off. <laughs> Pop your shit. Pop your shit, Lord. Let me Ew, get my Pilar talk. Yeah, yeah. Hey, bitch. I don't like Pilar. Block that bitch. Okay, so like they love me, but they really love me for real. No, one thing I'm gonna say, you definitely funny as shit, bro. Like, you like a real live comedian for real, for real. And I don't even try to be funny. Facts, though. So, now let's get to the shit, though, because, like, everybody in the city be like, Lord, backdoor queen. Like, if, if she in your video, you gotta, like, you mean you next type of shit. Like, where all that shit pretty much them from? All right, now, my ex boyfriend, King Glory, he died, and he got set up by a female. And being though everybody know he always was with me at the time, they thought it was me that lined him up, but it wasn't me. It was a whole different thing. Uh, but you know, that's the internet, it's me. Yeah. Motherfuckers gonna run with that shit, motherfuckers gonna have it dirty stuff, but his folks know what's up with me, his mom and dad, like, I still talk to them to this day. Like, right. they really got that in there. As far as other niggas lying, they ain't shooting each other today. They're not shit with me. Right. Like, Cause not to go too deep and shit, but I seen what um recently when the, the boy from North Man Man in the situation with that, and I was on like motherfuckers are just be tagging you like like so anybody died in the city. That nigga even died. That motherfuckers, I get on live. Motherfuckers like you lied. I'm like I don't know the nigga. Never been around nigga. Never chill with him. Don't have no worry about somebody. Nothing. How would I do anything? Facts though. So like you more so like running with the biz since they kinda like putting that name on you and shit. You got troll the trolls. Okay. The like they be trolling me, so I troll me. Oh, that's a fact. It's definitely a good way to carry because you got you know a lot of other people in the city, you ain't really strong. They let that shit break them, they start crying and changing who they I is and shit like that. I'm always gonna be me. I've been me. I'm never gonna change. I'm gonna be as blunt, outspoken, and bold as I always been. Facts, facts. So how was it for like you coming up in Philly though? Cause this is definitely one of the, you know how the city lie. is. I had a poor like, like, I just sell drugs, all that type of shit. But then I stopped with some little kids, started doing other little shit. But it feels like poor, it is. But I got my shit together. I'm going Chanel, yeah. Three kids, on credit, on board, on shit. Good credit. Talk about that though, cause you definitely working. Hey, we gonna talk about the OnlyFans. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> when I see you, I'm like, huh? The Only? I'm like, damn. Real shit though. Got respected though. I got the OnlyFans hustle, close friends hustle. I do TV, all types of shit. You name it, I'm so, getting money. So talk about that though. Um, just speaking, um, speaking up for the ladies and shit, cause. Coming from the city, not just the city, just our culture is like a lot of chicks be like single moms and they be on a grind, they be working two, three jobs. Like my mom was a single mom. She worked like two jobs and was hustling on the side just to make ends meet. So talk about that for a little bit. Yeah, as far as now my first baby father, he's not really around. He's a jailbird, so I had two kids by him. And I've been doing this shit, I've been thugging this shit out like six and seven years. I've really been thugging this shit out since I was 15. And my first kid at 15, second at 16. Mm. So I really been thugging that shit out by myself. Of course I got female support, but you come from a single or double parent household. I come from a single parent household. Okay. I'm out there single. So I already know how to do shit, keep the shit. I'm independent like my mother. Real yeah, shit. So it's like that mom shit, it's not hard, people make it work. You gotta have patience. Mm -hmm. That's all it really is, is patience. You little kids patience, like. Yeah, real shit though. But I ain't gonna we definitely gonna do a sit down. We gonna get into it, really into it and shit like that and get your story for the people. Cause one thing I say about you, I could tell like you really just be bit and, and you be doing your own thing and niggas are kind of like, I literally will watch it live and people will just start tagging you and they're like, Pilar did it. You won't even be in the live and shit hey, like nigga. that. But I like how you kind of run with that and then you know, utilize it to your advantage and shit like that. I'm actually about to come up with a podcast so make sure y'all still there. Ooh, that's a good joint. So yeah, we gonna really sit down and you know saying get your story for the city, you know what I'm saying? Thanks so. Facts. Now, I ain't gonna hold you, I feel like this wild lot of motherfuckers, especially the chicks, be fucking with Pilar and they be, you know what I'm saying? You got, you know, that type of audience and shit he like that. He had a piece, like, Nick, he said this bitch don't everybody want Everybody went through the same struggle, everybody got the same <laughs> story, everybody can relate to the same yeah. shit. So like, Niggas don't like when you do them. Me, how they do 15, two kids. That's a lot for real, for real, you know what I'm saying? Especially just coming up in, you know mean? How you, about the how you knew what, what I was talking know? about? What? I mean, Pilar, you got everything to do with it. Like. All right, so before we move forward, 
I want to take a step back. On season two, it starts off. The bull called Pilar. She pick up, she go around, see him, yada yada. They get mad, he kick her out. And then she call the other bull, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know where you live at. You know this bitch that can trust right now? I got me. Get the fuck out, cuz. Oh, yeah, all right, watch this. Watch this. Like this shit happened every day. This shit is nothing new. Shit like this yeah. really go on. For like the image of Pilar was painted since a youngin. She might not even know it. Uh, she on point. Who in this car? This ain't like eight more times. I swear. I be on shit. So why they be saying that you don't never come outside? You left the city. I just don't live in the city, like, I That's live elsewhere. Leveled but up. But I know I can come to the city anytime. So, how, how you feeling about the culture of Philly right now, or just overall? <sighs> What's real shit? As far as, like, the shit is done. As far as the music shit, we getting somewhere. Yeah. I fuck with a couple of Philly rappers. We got, we got dirt for the... Ooh. <laughs> Facts, we got dirt for the Cupid joint. I fuck with Rear. I fucks with uh, Cheeto. I fucks with YM from Richard Allen. That's my folks. But Facts, though. I fuck with who else? Of course, my nigga can't even though he's going, he's still going to play his shit. I listen to a couple niggas. I like, uh. Hit you back. Tour. Boy, uh, don't ever play a beef around me, though. I'm gonna yeah, we're we'll talking about that, though. Why you be saying that, though? Because I definitely need somebody. I don't fuck with him because of the dick eater. I ain't going, I'm going to let you speak your mind, though. Why you feel like that? This ain't even his shit that he jumped in the shit. Like. Hey, yo, chill, bro. Chill, we dry. Chill. Fuck the niggas, you know what I mean? Hey, yo, no, for the Burger King lawyer, you know what I mean? Hey, yo, I ain't going to hold you. This drill shit. This shit got Philly turned. Like, everybody going through it. I mean, yo, I see everybody, everybody going through it. Everybody going through it with somebody. It's like, niggas getting popping, dissing the option, shit like that, you feel me? A lot of motherfuckers probably going for some type of way or why you putting this in the joint, but on some shit, bro, this joint all over line. Like, this shit is on 100 pages, bro. This shit got 70,000 views and shit like that. And it's like, as an artist, it's like, the motherfucker put that shit out there on the net, bro. You know what I'm talking about, like, he's mm. a dick eater, like, he's a dick eater, but that's great. And he should be, where'd you from? You from P&P and Tasker, what? Like, <laughs> so you knew Leaf, like, before, as far as the whole... Yeah, I knew him before all this shit happened. I knew him before the beef and shit started. Mind you, when I met my nigga, I did not know that's what was going on to, like, shit. But, but right. one thing about me, I don't really get into if I fuck with you, I fuck with you. But he made me not fuck with him, like, cause I've been with him before, Lord. Before I even knew Lord, I, I knew him. Like. Okay. Cause speak about that, cause he actually even says like he mentioned you for for yeah, one of like the rap yeah, songs and shit. So right. I ain't gonna hold you. When I heard that joint, I was like, what the fuck, like that shit shocked me for real, for real. Uh, fuck the odds from the bottom of my heart. She fuck might got a curse on her. Why y'all hanging with Pilar? Speaking on my dick, niggas, I can get you on tomorrow. She turned her whole name up for real, for real, and like her image is farther than me and shit like that. 
And then it was other little verses and shit like that what kind of made it seem like I ain't rules you. That's definitely one of the most legendary lines in Philly and shit like that. Like that shit, everybody was saying that. Bro, I'm dangerous. Bro, how am I dangerous? What curses on me? My pussy? Mm. <laughs> I'm saying so uh, after that, did you like, did your buzz go up in the city? Like, was motherfuckers really starting to yeah, like? Yeah, like motherfuckers every time in my comments, all that. Why you ain't with my Lord? She might got grip on that leaf word shit. It's cool though, you be carrying it though, like I said, I definitely like how you just be rolling with the punches for real, you try to turn all the negatives and the positives and shit, and you definitely be running that bag up talking your shit, you know what I mean? Sure. That's all, uh, talk your shit. G-Machi. <laughs> On me, G-Machi. You know what I mean? Wait for it. Facts. So now, let's talk about the type of niggas Laura into though, because like I said, obviously niggas be I'm on you. Run, you mean? Run, 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 run. I don't know, no, no, bitch. <laughs> no, because you know niggas be on you, they be shooting, they no, shot, they be in your comments. I don't discriminate, like, I didn't talk to, I didn't talk to a broke nigga before, because, like, huh? I didn't talk to all types of niggas, like. What was it about the broke nigga that got you? I mean, not a broke like nigga, the, but we all had a broke in a bubble for yeah, you, yeah, know, everybody dealt with him, but doesn't need to hear with her, that's past tense, like, I'm here and I talk to niggas that got money, yeah. ball players, niggas that work, you can work, I take nine to five niggas. Not the good, but um, I only say that because I had a conversation with somebody and he was saying like, no, y'all, especially niggas that get money, they think, but what it was it about that one broke nigga that even let him to get through the... It be the dick. <laughs> <laughs> Them niggas got the best dick. <laughs> it be fucking for survival. For survival. <laughs> Fact. So you ever deal with like a nigga who ain't had over the state type of shit? He was trying to like, or oh, yeah. that's it. Mm -hmm. For sure, like I didn't know a nigga like that, but like he didn't let me know that. It's just like I put two ones for the girl, like. <laughs> oh, alright. Yeah, I put two ones for the girl, and like yeah, he wasn't on. He really was doing something, and I just cut him off. Like. Mm, okay, so you go and finish up whatever, because now you say you fuck with niggas that get money, ball playing type niggas and shit like that. that like they gotta come correct. Correct, gotta come correct. That's all. Uh, and no. if you got that money, spend it. Mm -hmm. Don't talk that money shit, spend it. Real shit. So how you feel about a lot of these pages, though? A lot of the blog pages and shit? Cause they I ain't gonna that lie, be... I don't like that stuff page. Because, <laughs> like, they be on my dick bed, like. And also, I don't like Philly really football. I don't give a fuck how much they say they fuck with me. I don't fuck with them. Like, don't post me on your blogs. Defamation of character. I don't like y'all. Mm, real shit. As far as Elvis doing, I can't keep the fuck up. Like, I got so many big pages on me. The boss is talking shit. Like, I see little shit. I pay attention to little shit. But otherwise, I'm just doing me. I'm in my own world. Mm -hmm. like, so what niggas is you do got your eye on in the city? Like, you know what I'm saying? Don't fucking buy. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody at all. I'm with OT niggas now. Ooh, that's all. Level up. <laughs> no, real shit. I ain't been talking to nobody in the city with Mm-hmm. I've been chilling. I done had my room with these niggas. Don't move. But, I didn't have my run with you, Want to be red president, scammer president, but you need it, like. So in the series, you know, what you think makes Philly Philly? Me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so Philly, like. Mm. Can't tell. <laughs> That's heavy. <laughs> yeah. But, no, what, what makes Philly Philly is me and me. I don't even know how that's explaining me. I'm from Philly, and I'm so Philly. I feel that. So what made you you? Huh? What makes you you? What makes me me by being me? Nobody mm. else. Not pretending to be somebody I'm not. That's what makes me me. That's mm. a fact. That's a good job. So yeah, we gonna let you talk your shit, whatever else. You know what I'm saying? We gonna tap in and out. Shit like that. Anytime you wanna pop your shit, let us know, you know what I mean? For sure. Like I said, y'all, we gonna